Hello, guys. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Um, teacher, I have a question. Yes. Um, mm -hmm. uh, can I only listen in this class because I am working in this moment? Okay, that's not a problem. That's okay. Thank you very much for okay. letting me know. Mm -hmm. Thank you, teacher. Okay, no, thank you for being responsible. All right, so uh, we're just gonna wait for see you in this case for probably uh, one of your classmates. Because as you heard, Rodrigo, he's gonna be here, but he's not gonna be participating. So can you listen to me, Rocio? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Rodrigo. Yes, I, I can hear teacher. Okay, good. All right, so uh, probably your classmates are going to connect in a moment. Because I see that the majority of this group are, are having problems trying to connect in the Zoom. Because it's, it's very difficult. And now with the new updates that we have, um, well, it's a little bit difficult. But it is what it is, right? So we're, we have to work and do what we have to do. So um, let's see, uh, Rocio, in this case, I would like to know what you remember about yesterday's class. Do you remember anything or something that you could tell me about it? Mm, yes, uh, yesterday uh, articles. The artic articles you mean or what? Yes, the, the articles mm -hmm. and the position the articles or the order. Oh, the order of the adjectives, you mean? Order or or the adjectives. Mm -hmm. Adjectives. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, I see that we got, the, let me see now, we already have Luis Montano, we have Georgina, and we have Luis Chavez. Welcome, guys. Um, well, um, can some one of you tell me about yesterday's class? What is number one? of type of the adjectives. Who remembers which one is number one? What type of adjectives are located in number one? Opinion. Adjectives of opinion. Excellent, Georgina. Thank you very much. Now, which ones do we have in number two? Does any one of you remember? Adjective, size, length. Yeah, that, yeah that's, that's okay. Adjectives of length, size, and height. Thank you so much. So what hey. the others? For example, in number three, which one do we have? Luis Montano, Luis Chavez. Uh -huh. What do you guys remember? Can you guys listen to me? I mean, Luis Chavez, both Luis, ambos Luis, can you hear me? Hi. Mm, no le escuché, teacher. Oh, okay. So I was Repeat. I was asking what type of adjectives do we have in number three? Mm. 
Mm, the last practice uh, yesterday, teacher. Mm, no. How I do you understand? No, I mean, I'm talking uh, about the type. Quality. Mm -hmm. Physical quality, correct, uh, Luis Montano. That's the one we have in number three. Okay, what about number four? Adjective number. Adjectives of what? Uh, are you are you listening well to me, guys? Uh, I don't know if the signal. No sé si es que la señal se está cortando or what. But I cannot listen to you that clear. Number four, mm -hmm. age. Age, yeah, number four, we have age. Correct. What about number five? Shape. We have shape, okay. What else do we have in number six? Color. Color. Number seven. Origin. Origin, correct. Number eight. Material. Material. And what is the last one? What is the last one, guys? Purpose, teacher. Purpose. Okay, now I have a question for you. Does anyone of you already finish the platform? Oh, I know. No, okay. So what about the others? Alguien de ustedes ya terminó la plataforma? No, teacher, a mí me falta. Exercises. Okay. Um, because I was asking you because I need to verify if uh if everything is okay with the platform. So if some one of you, si alguien de ustedes termina in this week or the first days, los primeros días de la próxima semana, please let me know. So uh, I can verify that everything is okay. Because sometimes, algunas veces tenemos problemas y algunos alumnos no les aparecen los certificados. So that's why. Es por eso que necesito saber cuando ya hayan terminado que sí les aparezca la opción de certificate. So with that, uh, we can um, we can assure or we can confirm that everything is okay. So um, for today's class, guys, we are going to see a little bit of vocabulary today. Yesterday, we saw uh, the different types of adjectives and the position or order of the adjectives that we have in English. So today, we're going to focus a little bit on, on vocabulary and we go, we're going to talk about some parts of the food pyramid. So, but before we start, I would like to verify if you understood the, uh, the adjectives. So we are going to have a practice. I need you to have right now pen, paper and pencil so we can start with the practice of today. So you let me know when you're ready so we can start. Are you guys ready? The only one that is not going. All right. Okay. Thank you so much, uh, Rocio, for confirming. 
The only one that is not going to be here with us is Rodrigo because he has a situation there in doing something. So Luis Chavez, Luis Montano, Andrea, Georgina, are you ready? I am ready. Okay, good. So the practice that we're going to have is that is about the adjectives that we saw yesterday. For example, um, let me just check. Yesterday we we were doing some exercises about about adjectives, but at the end you were not able to complete them because we didn't have enough time. So, uh, for example, right now I'm going to give you, les voy a dar una lista de adjectives y lo que necesito es que a la par de esa lista de adjectives, you write, que escriban el tipo de adjective que es. So let me just share the screen with you so you can have the, this part right here. So, can you guys see it? Si pueden ver, can you see the presentation or no yet? Está cargando, teacher. It's loading, okay. Is homework yesterday? No, that's different. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. I can see. I can see. All right. So this one, because the one la que les, les mostré el día de ayer, it was another, but this one is another. Some those are some other adjectives. So in this one, what I need you to do is that. Next to it, a la par de este, necesito que me escriban o en su cuaderno, in your notebook, qué tipo, what type of adjective is. Qué tipo de adjetivo es based on the ones that we saw yesterday, basados en los que vimos ayer. So you have uh, uh, the most three minutes to do that. So you know we have 10. Tenemos 10 adjectives. So I will still have this presentation here. Todavía voy a tener acá uh, para que puedan verla. So you can do that in your notebook. When you finish, when the time is over, cuando el tiempo se termine, I will let you know. So you can send the picture through WhatsApp. Christian, uh, I just saw that you connected. Christian, did you listen to what I said? Yes, good evening, teacher. Good evening. Yes. Okay, good. Did you say something, Rocio? Uh, perdón, perdón, uh -huh. estaba... Pensando en voz alta. Ah, oh, ok. <laughs> It's ok. So we just have one more minute. Nos queda un minuto más to complete it. And then you will have to send it. Oh, I already received some. Ya recibí one. No, no, you're not. No, okay, no, that's another thing.
Okay, so I will stop sharing right now. And I will need you right now to send the photo or the screenshot or the picture through the WhatsApp group just for me to verify that you worked on the activity that we just had. Okay, so I haven't received anyone yet. Are you still working on that or what's going on? WhatsApp group, teacher? Yeah, to the WhatsApp group. Okay. I haven't received anyone yet. Okay, I received already, Rocio. Okay, thanks so much, Rocio. I already received Christian. I guess that's you, Christian. Yeah, Christian, I guess. Christian, okay. Are you a doctor, Christian, by any chance? Excuse me? Are you a doctor? No. Because <laughs> your, your handwriting looks like a doctor handwriting. Yeah, me <laughs> it looks like that. Like when they say paracetamol or, or acetaminophen, that is very difficult sometimes. <laughs> yeah, Luis, okay. Thank you very much, Luis. Montano. So I'm, I'm waiting for Andrea, waiting for Georgina, waiting for Luis Chavez. And I see that now we got connected Claudia. Claudia, I, I see you until today. What happened with you during the week? ¿Qué pasó contigo durante la semana? I didn't see you during the week till today. Hello. Tuve un inconveniente, teacher, por eso no me había conectado. Ah, okay. Sí. All right. Okay, guys, I haven't received the others. So we're going to move on and I'm expecting to receive the others. If not, caso contrario, solo tendríamos a Luis, a Christian, and also to receive you. Serían los únicos con la participación de este día. So the others, I don't know. All right, so we're gonna move on to today's class, guys. And as I was telling you before, class of today is going to be a little bit of vocabulary, let's say, about, uh, this case, food pyramid. We're going to talk about that today, about food pyramid, and we're going to see some things that are good for your health and some other things that we don't have to do when it comes to the food pyramid. So uh, let me just share the screen with you so you can have an idea of what I'm talking about. Here. Okay, here we have, it says food pyramid. So, oh, today is now our 10th. Today is our 11th. Today is our 11th class, guys, and we just have tomorrow's class, and then next week we are going to finish classes on Thursday. La siguiente semana terminamos clases on Thursday, okay? So, I'm telling you since now, se los voy a decir desde ahorita, el último día de clases, please, no falte porque vamos a hacer la evaluación final del módulo. So if you miss that, si usted falta, automáticamente va a perder esa nota. So we're going to have the exam 
the last day of classes. El último día de clases, which is going to be next Thursday. Thursday, I'm sorry, next week. Okay. So I'm telling you since now. Se los digo desde ya, so you can be ready para que se prepare. So the exam is okay. going to be about all the tenses that we saw, or I mean all the topics, todos los temas que ya, que ya hemos visto en el módulo. So, no va a haber ningún problema because si usted no preguntó es porque lo entendió. So it means that you won't have any problem in that exam. The exam, dependiendo si todos entran a la clase, Se va a ver si se hace in, in, in pairs, en, en pareja, o si se hace individual, dependiendo de, eh, dependiendo de cuánto se presente en ese día. Ok, so now, we're going to move on with what we have for today, and we're going to start with the food pyramid information. And here, I want to, I want to know for you, En su opinión, chicos. Here, the cereal, pastas, potatoes, and bread, or rice, in which part of the food pyramid can we place them? ¿En qué parte de la food pyramid lo podríamos agregar? Number one, number two, number three, or where? Which one do you think, or where do you think we should place it? Two. Number two? Okay. If we have number two, it's going to be here. What about fruits and vegetables? Where could we place them? Number three, three perdón. Number three, let's see. We're gonna place them here. Now, what about milk, cheese, yogurt, and butter? Where do you think we should place it? At first, at fourth, or at fifth? Four, at four. Four, okay. What about meat? Fish and eggs. The first. The first, okay. And of course, the last one, this one is going to be and the last one. Oh, do you know all the words that we have here? Si entienden todas las palabras que tenemos aquí. Butter, that's butter. Teacher. Yes. Mm, bueno, se lo hace en español. Creo que el orden que usted está percibiendo, pues, que yo tengo es al revés. I mean, this... Cuando dije four, four es de arriba hacia abajo. Perdón, de abajo hacia arriba. Yeah. Mm, no, de arriba oh. hacia abajo. From, from, from up to, to below. Sí, porque así está mal la, la, la... Sí, está mal la distribución. Yeah, no well, yes, we were just we were just trying to see how how we do now. We're gonna go right now to the to the correct one. Vamos a ver cuáles deberían ser las posiciones correctas. So we're gonna move here. Just let me click in here. And here we have the correct positions. So, it is fat and sweets, meat, fish, and eggs, milk, cheese, yogurt, butter, fruit, vegetables, and cereal, pasta, potatoes, and rice. So, this is the order that we, sh that we should have or that we're supposed to have. Now, I'm going to listen to every one of you doing the pronunciation of all the words that we have there. Now, let's see, we we'll start with, uh, with Christian. Christian, can you please go ahead? Make the pronunciation of all of them. 
Perdón. I need you to make the pronunciation of all the words that we have here. Okay. Uh, fast and sweet. All, all teacher. Yes, all the words. Okay. Uh, number two, uh, meat, fish, and egg. Eggs. Uh, three, milk, cheese, yogurt, butter. Butter, okay. Uh, next, uh, fruit and vegetables. Okay. Uh, um, cereal, pasta, potato, bread, and rice. Okay, this one, Christian, we do not say cereal. We say cereal. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Thank you very much. Now we're going to move on with Luis Chavez. Yeah, teacher. Yes. Desde arriba, desde. Yeah, we start from the top to the bottom. Okay. Fast and sweet. Meat, fish, egg, meal, eggs. Milk, eggs. Eggs, mm -hmm. eggs, milk, cheeses, yogurt, butter, fruits, and vegetables. Cereal. We say vegetables. Fruits and vegetables. No, no, no. Say it again. Vegetables. Vegetables. Correct. Cereals, pasta, potatoes, bread, rice. Oh, we say this one bread, pan, bread. Bread. Correct. Excellent. Thank you so much. Rocio, can you do the same thing? Yes. Fat and sweet. Mm -hmm. Meat, fish, eggs, milk, cheese, yogurt, butter, mm -hmm. fruits and vegetables, cereal, pasta, potato, bread, and rice. Okay, thank you so much. We'll go with your Gina. Okay. Uh, fast and sweet. Okay. Meat. Fish. Egg. Milk. Cheese. Yogurt. Uh, butter. Okay. Fruits and vegetable, cereal, pasta, potatoes, bread, bread rice. Say bread. Bread and rice. Correct. Thank you so much. Now we we'll go with Luis Montano. Fat, eh, fast and squid. No, we say fats and sweets. Fats and sweets. Meat, fish, egg, meal, mm -hmm. cheese, mm -hmm. yogurt, okay. butter. Butter, okay. Fruits and Vegetable. Listen, vegetables. Vegetable. Vegetables. Cereal. Okay. Pasta. Potato. Bread. Rice. Mm -hmm. No, we say bread and rice. Bread and rice. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Now we're going to go. The last one is going to be with you, uh, Claudia. Okay. Fat 
and sweet, meat, mm. fish, mm. egg, meat, cheese, yogurt, butter, fruits um, and vegetables, cereals, pasta, potato, bread, okay. and rice. Rice. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Now we're going to move on and we will have some information about the types of things that we have on the food pyramid. For example, we can have grains, we can have vegetables, we can have fruits, we can have oils, milk, meat, and beans. Those are some other parts that we have on the food pyramid. Now we're going to move on and we are going to have, going to go uh, each one of them. And first of all, we have grains. For example, it says grains make half of your grains whole. Now, I would like to listen to you, Christian, helping me with number one, this one, and number two. Okay. Some examples of grain are of meal, wheat, mm -hmm. Rice and barley. Good. Whole grain with bread is better for you than white bread. Thank you very much. Andrea, I will need your help with number three and number four. Okay. Cereals are grain like che che Cheerios. Okay. Mini Mini wheat, wax, okay. and bran flax. Mini wax and bran flax. Children should have six serving of grain a day. Okay, good, excellent. So this is guys basically just general information that we have about grains and some things or some recommendations about what we should do when we have a, uh, some things and talking specifically about the grains. Uh, now, is there any question that you might have this part? Teacher, uh, what is the mean uh, oatmeal? Oatmeal is what we call avena. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. um, the next with with is what we call trigo. Trigo. Okay. That's Good. So we're gonna move on to the next one, and here we have some parts of the vegetables. Vegetables. We can also say, uh, if you are in a familiar way, si estás de una uh, forma familiar. Ustedes también se le pueden decir veggies. So if we have, you know, if you're talking with your friend, hablando con algún amigo or someone, uh, you can say, oh, veggies. And by saying veggies, you refer to vegetables, okay? That's just a way of saying the short way, una forma más corta de decir vegetables. Now, uh, I would like to listen to, and this part to Georgina to help me with number one. Okay. Uh, vegetable include uh, carrot, mm -hmm. uh, broccoli, what, what is pronunciation? <laughs> broccoli is broccoli. Uh, broccoli, mm -hmm. beans, um peppers mm -hmm. uh let lettuce lettuce mm -hmm. and tomatoes and tomatoes okay uh now thank you very much uh georgina go with rocio rocio help me with number two okay you need to in Orange and red. What is your color for the best balance of vitamins and nutrients? Okay, vitamins, 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 and nutrients. 
nutrients, okay? What it says there, guys, is that we have to balance the vitamins or vitamins. Hay algunas partes in the United States where they say vitamins. Some other parts of the United States, they say vitamins. So both pronunciations in that case are okay. Now, we're going to go with the last part, and I'm going to need, in this case, uh, Luis Montano, can you help me with this part? Children need to... ¿Cómo se pronuncia un medio? Health. House. Cups of... Cups. ¿Cómo? Cups. Cups of... Ese se me olvida. Vegetables. Vegetable a day. A day. A day. day. Okay, good. So we have here uh, uh, information, general information about vegetables. And in this case, if there's no question, we're going to move on to another part. And here we have a little bit of vocabulary. And in this part of the vocabulary, uh, for example, cucumber, let's, I will, I will say it, guys, lo voy a decir, and then I will ask you to repeat it, okay? So this is just vocabulary that we have. I will repeat each word two times. Voy a repetir cada palabra dos veces, and then I will ask you for the pronunciation. Now, we start. We start with cucumber, 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 yellow onion, yellow onion, red onion, red onion, garlic, garlic, carrot, carrot, red cabbage, red cabbage, white cabbage, White cabbage, radish, radish, eggplant, eggplant, mushroom, mushroom, red pepper, red pepper, artichoke, artichoke, corn, corn, beet. Beet, broccoli, broccoli, cauliflower, cauliflower, celery, celery, red chili, red chili, green chili, green chili, sweet potato, sweet potato. Asparagus, asparagus, olives, olives, pumpkin, 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 fennel, 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 spring onion, spring onion, turnip. Turnip, green bean, green bean, avocado, avocado, lettuce, lettuce, and zucchini, zucchini. Now we're going to start. Empezamos. Let's see. We're going to go with, let me see who we have here. Christian, Christian, let's go with you. Let's start with you, Christian, and then we're going to go with Rocio. I need you to help me with the first line, horizontal, please. La primera fila, the first line. The first line, horizontal. Okay. Cucumber, mm -hmm. yellow onion. Good. Royal. Onion. Good. Garlic. Carrot. 
Excellent. Thank you so much. Now we go with Rocio. Line number two, horizontal. Red cabbage. 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 Good. Excellent. Right. Cabbage. Radian. No. Excellent. Radish. Radish. Mm -hmm. Radish. Excellent. Mm -hmm. And mushroom. Mushroom. Excellent. Now we move on with Andrea. Andrea, line number three, Andrea. Red pepper. Mm -hmm. Artichoke. 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 Corn. Corn. Okay. Beet. 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 Broccoli. 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 Excellent. That was good. Now we'll go with Georgina. Is cauliflower. 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 Excellent. Uh, celery. Celery. Mm -hmm. Red chili. Okay. Green chili. Okay. Sweet potato. Excellent. Now we're going to go with Claudia. Uh, Argus. Argus. Ese el siguiente no escuché cómo se pronuncia. Olives. Olives. Eh, pumpkin. Pumpkin, okay. Pumpkin. Uh, mm. spring onion spring onion okay thank you now we're going to finish with you uh, Luis Chavez we're going to finish with you turning uh -huh. grand bint Green bean. Green bean. Avocado. 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 Lettuce. 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 No, y ese no sé cómo se pronuncia, teacher. Zucchini. Zucchini. Okay, good. Now, is there any question so far? Any question, guys? Okay. No. No, good. So now we're going to move on and we go with the fruits. Vamos con las frutas. So let's see, Rocio, help me with the first two, number one and number two, please. Rocio? Okay, okay. Fruits contain a wide variety of vitamins. Mm -hmm. Fruits like pineapples. Pineapple. Uh, pineapples, apples, orange, peaches, apricot, and pears mm -hmm. are readily available. 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 Good. Now, I need uh, your help. Let's see, Luis Montano. Can you help me with number three and number four? Fresh, fresh is best. Fresh, fresh, fresh best. Fresh is best. Mm -hmm. But can't. But can't. Como? But canned. But canned. Mm -hmm. Or frozen. Mm -hmm. Or fried. Or oh, of oh, oh, season. Okay. Children need one. 
Esa se me olvidó. Y Luis, Juan. You forgot it already. What eh, else? Un medio. Un medio. Hall. Juan Hall. Repeat. We say one half. House. Ok. Ahorita lo anoté. One house. Cut. Cut. Fruit. Every day. Of fruits every day. Ok. What it's saying there. It's giving once again. Oh. Some recommendations. About how many. Or how much. You should eat. Uh, eat fruits. So now we're going to go with the vocabulary of fruits. And here we have some parts or some words of the vocabulary. Now I'm going to do the same thing. Voy a hacer la misma cosa. I repeat it twice, dos veces, and then I ask you to participate. Now, please listen. Banana, banana, mango, mango, custard apple. Custard apple, watermelon, watermelon, coconut, coconut, fig, fig, grape, grape, orange, orange, star fruit, star fruit, guava. Guava, papaya, papaya, lychee, lychee, passion fruit, passion fruit, water apple, water apple, pomegranate, pomegranate, lemon. Lemon, grapefruit, grapefruit, chico, chico, pineapple, pineapple, marshmallow, musk melon, dragon fruit, dragon fruit, jack fruit. Jack fruit, rambutan, rambutan, kiwi, kiwi, once again, avocado, avocado, langan, langan, mangosteen, mangosteen, canistel, canistel. Those are some uh, parts of the vocabulary that we have about fruits. But honestly, guys, there are some fruits that I don't know. Hay algunas frutas that we don't have in El Salvador. For example, in El Salvador, we don't have canicel. We don't have, uh, let's see, passion fruit. I don't think that, no, I think, yes, we have passion fruit. What we don't have is Chico. We don't have Chico. We don't have, uh, what else we don't have? I guess, well, I guess those are the only ones that we don't have. Then the others we do. So now let's see, we're gonna go with uh, Andrea. Andrea, I will ask you to help me with line number nine, horizontal. Okay, question number nine. Okay, no, I, I was just asking you to help me read line number na number one, I'm sorry, horizontal. Okay. Banana. Okay. Coconut. No, no, no. Horizontal. Oh, perdón. Mm -hmm. Banana. Mm -hmm. Mango. Uh -huh. Custard. Custard apple. Okay. Watermelon. Thank you very much. Christian. Okay. Coconut. Mm -hmm. Fig. Fig. Go ahead. Excuse me? Fig. Fig. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. Grape, orange. Okay, good. Thank you very much. Let's see, um, Luis Chavez. Co coconut? No, no, no. Here. Oh, oh. Is, is starfruit? Is starfruit. Uh, guava. Yes. Papaya. 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 Yeah, it sounds uh, weird. Leche. Uh -huh. leche. Good. Sé que suena raro, chicos, porque, por ejemplo, se escribe papaya, but it, it's pronounced different. And, and, you know, in Spanish, we say papaya, but in English, they say papaya. That's, it sounds weird. Sé que suena raro, but that's English. So we have to do it in that way. So let's see. Uh, Georgina, can you help me, Georgina, with the next one? Uh, passion fruit. Passion Passion fruits. Water apple. Mm -hmm. uh, grenade. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Palm grenade. Palm grenade. Mm -hmm. Lemon. Okay, now we're going to go with Claudia. Uh -huh. Chico, okay. Chico, Chico, uh, Chico, okay. Chico, Apple, uh, okay. Um, melon, musk melon, okay, good. All right, so now we're gonna go with. The last line in, I will need, let's see, um, Luis Montano, help me with this one. Dragon fruit. Mm -hmm. Jack fruit. Rambutan. Mm -hmm. Kiwi. Kiwi. All right, now I will ask once again, Rocio, if you can help me, Rocio. Okay. Avocado. Avocado, okay. Duncan. Mm -hmm. Mango skin. Mm -hmm. Canister. Canister, okay, good. Now we're gonna go, guys, quickly to a small practice. Una pequeña práctica va a ser super rápido. So we don't, we're not gonna take that much. No nos va a tomar mucho tiempo. So here, this is what we're gonna do. Uh, let me show that to you. Déjeme mostrárselo so you can have an idea. See this one right here. So just let me share. Okay. Can you see it? That, what I need you to do, guys, in that part is that you have to select, solo tienen que elegir whether it is A or N. That's it. Or some and any or much and many. So you will have to select that. Please try to take a screenshot. So I'm going to create a breakout room and I'm going to send you to work. Oh, I'm sorry. I moved it, but I guess it was okay. So I'm going to create here the breakout rooms, and I will ask you to go. Let's see. Teacher. Yes. How many? ¿Cuántas láminas eran? No, just one. What? Oh, okay, okay. Yes, only one. So now, let me see. We're going to go to the breakout rooms. Please, go ahead and join. Okay.
Luis Chavez and Christian, do you have any problem? Um, no. So why didn't you join? Dijo que escogiéramos, ¿verdad? Y mandamos la al grupo la foto. I mean, yes, but I created the breakup rooms. Creé los grupos para que trabajaran juntos, so you didn't join. No, no, te uniste. Ah, no, 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 no me dio la opción. Okay, let me just. So in that case, you know what? You can work by yourself. Puedes trabajar yourself right now because we don't have, we just have uh, three more minutes. Solo nos quedan como tres minutos más. So that's fine. And then you can send it through the WhatsApp group. So I guess you finished for CEO, right? Correct? Because it was really easy. Yes, teacher, pero por error me salí. Por no, it's okay. no, it's okay. I canceled the, the groups. So now we're um, wait, no, okay. wait, waiting for the others to come back yeah, before we finish with that. Okay. okay, I can see now that the majority has come back. So guys, uh, well, that was just a, a very small practice and well, it's going to be pretty much all for today. Thank you so much for being here, for your responsibility. And that's going to be all for today, guys. Thank you very much. And see you tomorrow at the same time by the same channel, okay? Have a good night, you all. Good night. Good night. Good night, good night. Good night.